Welcome back everyone. In this uh, video we're going to be taking a look at how to create a symbol, some of the pre-existing templates in SiteTech, maybe how to change the logo on some of these pages and templates. So let's get right to it. Okay, first of all, I'm going to create a copy of this um, SXW uh, style include over here. Um, copy project 2 and let's uh, to uh, copy to a new project let's call this my style include and it's going to be putting it into that um, path do you wish to create a copy yes Okay, so if I look in the My Style Include project under Graphics, under Templates, I can see the SXW Style 1 template. Now we are going to create a copy of this and call it My Style 1. For that, I'm going to have to right click My Style Include, go to Open Project Folder, look for the SXW Style 1. .cttfrm tmp these three files control c control v copy and paste and rename uh, this one as my star one dot ctt this one as my star one dot frm this as my star one TMP. Okay, now I'm going to close this out. And if I check again under graphics templates, I'm still going to see SXW style 1. So let me close the Cytec Explorer and reopen it. Now, if I look in My Style Include project under graphics templates, I can see the My Style 1 copy. Okay, next I'm going to go into the My Style 1 folder into HD768 and I'm going to be looking at the templates. Let's go into normal and you see how uh, on the top left corner you have the SCADA Expert Visual Site Tech logo. I'm going to be changing this to Let's change uh, this logo here to a custom logo. To make a custom logo, I'm going to be going into new, create a new symbol. For the symbol, I'm going to select this one that I created here. It's my own name. It's a 285 by 68 pixel in size, created in paint. Uh, I'm going to be dragging and dropping it here. Put it right close to the crosshairs. And save this as. Create a new library. I'm going to call it my underscore logo. And give the symbol a name. Close this out, go back to the normal template, click on the logo there and set this to the one that I just created, my logo library, this logo right here. This is going to be my my logo dot my name. Voila. Okay, so I'm going to save this. Please use update pages. Okay. We'll do that in the end. For that, uh, I'm going to be going next into the other templates. Let's go into alarm. I click 
over here, look at page properties, you can see the style as set to SXW style 1. We need to change that to my style 1. But before I do that, I need to double click on uh, over here uh, and copy this. Then go to page properties, set it to my style 1. And then double click again and paste the equipment symbol library here. Okay. And save it. Then rinse and repeat uh, these steps for all the other templates. For example, go into data browse to change this logo here. Uh, first copy the equipment symbol library and go into page properties change the style here to my style one now that change this logo there double click and paste the equipment symbol library save okay so once you're done changing the logo for all these templates I would go into HD1080, uh, go into the right panel template, right click page properties and change the style here to my style 1. Save. Okay, then I would go into Site Project Editor and remember how. After you change the logo, you see a pop-up saying update pages. So to do a uh, page updation, go to SciTech Graphic Builder, Tools, Update Pages. Next, go to the My Style Include project. Go to Graphics. Go to Pages. And um, go to the SXW Style Startup page. Change the logo over here to the custom logo. Right click Page Properties, Appearance tab change the style to my style and save the change okay so next I'm going to create a new project based off of a starter project like my style include for this um, I go to my projects right click new project and let me call the new project my uh, HD768 underscore sharing. Create the project based off of the starter project. And the starter project for now I'm going to be selecting SXW style 1HD768. Okay. So that creates a starter project or that creates a new project based off of a, uh, an existing project. Highlight the MyStyle HD768 project. Go to Site Project Editor. Under the Systems tab, go into Included Projects. Change the SXW here to MyStyleInclude. Replace. Then go back to SciTech Explorer and under the new project you created, go to the graphic section, go into pages and change the style of these pages. For that, copy, right click page properties. Change the style here to my style one. See. Okay. 
Okay, so once you have changed uh, the style of all the other pages, let's go to Graphic Builder, go to File, Defaults, and change the default style here to My Style 1. Go to Tools and Update Pages. Okay, so to create a backup of this project, right click the project, go to Backup, select the project and save included projects as well. This is going to be the destination and click OK. Backup is complete. Now just to test it out, I'm going to go ahead and delete this project here. And also I'm going to delete the included project as well, which is my style include. And I'm going to try and restore by going here, right click and clicking on restore. Okay. Do you wish to create? Okay. There you go. Now if I right click and run this project, I see the project as initialized with my custom logo up here. If I check one of the pages, all right, I can still see my custom logo up there. Perfect. That's all I have for this video. Learned a little bit about templates, symbols, how to create a symbol, how to create a custom logo, how to backup a project and how to restore a project.